Hi, I'm Devan from Explore Science Discovery Centre in Wrexham. Today, we are going to show you how pulleys make lifting a load easier. Have you ever thought how Ponte Cassette Aqueduct was built? The cast iron parts of the trough were made at Plas Caneston Foundry at Cavan Mawr and the sandstone for the pillars was quarried in Cavan too. They were transported to site using tramways and carts. The cast iron and the stone blocks had to be hoisted from the ground to be fixed into place. This involved lifting a lot of heavy weights. To do this, they used a system of pulleys. A pulley is a simple machine consisting of a rope wrapped over one or more grooved wheels. It works by changing the direction of the force used to lift the load, allowing you to pull down on the rope to lift the load, rather than trying to pull it up from the ground yourself. This gives the benefit of working with gravity rather than against it. A single pulley can be used with a rope to hoist a load into position. Adding extra pulleys reduces the force needed to lift the load. The extra pulleys give mechanical advantage, enabling us to turn a small force into a larger force. This allows us to lift loads that would be far too heavy for us to lift unaided. A set of two pulleys, one at the top and one at the bottom, means that the force required to raise the load is halved, but the length of rope which needs to be pulled is doubled. This type of pulley system is sometimes called a block and tackle. Pulleys were also really important on the working canal, as they were used to load and unload cargo on and off the canal boats. There is still an old crane with a pulley at Llangollen Wharf. Have you enjoyed this demonstration? Then keep connected with Explore.